Hey love bugs, it's Riles. I'm back at you one more again. I hope everybody is doing blessed. I'm doing blessed and highly favored and definitely hope the same for you. And if this is your first time stopping by my channel, much love to you and welcome. And to my returning subs, my grown extended beautiful family, as always, thank you so much for the love and support. It is truly appreciated. So with that being said, much love to all. Namaste, love and blessings, love and light. And many blessings are definitely coming your way. And if you have been watching my videos for a while and have not already, please drop a line. I would love a chance to get to know you as much as you're getting to know me. And if you feel like the videos just give you a good vibe, they uplift, that you truly need it, please give a thumbs up and share. I'll be greatly appreciated. So, um... And sending in all that, you know, would be greatly appreciated. But to anybody who's coming in, you know, doing some low-level vibes, trying to block, destroy, you know, trying to do something. Everything is divinely, heavily protected and loved. So anything that you place it on here with evil eye is going right back to you, okay? 20 times full. Uh, the video I'm doing right now is called Twin Flame 101. Hey, oh, because you are strongly protected by the Most High. What comes to attack seen and unseen is only strengthening, uh, strengthens you. When I say, as soon as I said this, oh my God, my nose just start itching like crazy. I was doing this video and then accidentally pushed uh, record and instead of pushing pause because I was just like, what, when I was seeing what I was talking about, when I when I say it's at that point where there's a lot of different people that are, you know, uh, you, you're getting huge downloads, especially when it came to 11-11 and the, then the Equinox is getting ready to pop off or whatever, if it hadn't already, or you're you're feeling the vibes of it. And these are the different things that's taking place into your life where, you know, you're getting huge downloads, you know, you, you're seeing and, and being uh, told different things by universe, by your higher self, this, like, is this possible? Is this possible? And it was just like, even from what I'm hearing, God, dog my nose okay thank you Woo. okay i was just like is this something i need to be talking about or whatever it's making my nose it's like crazy so obviously i'm on that gift that it's supposed to be but um anyways different things are taking place where you are you went through a giant upgrade and this is what a lot of the the low level people that didn't want these to take place into your life because you know that there was a lot every time there is like a a strong moon that's taking place especially with 11 11 you know there's a, a lot of upgrades and alignments powerful alignments is taking place and there's a lot of people trying to steal people's essence you know uh an alive view um doing different things trying to create chaos spells for you to self-sabotage yourself on blessings hoping that you missed one that's coming around all these different things and it's gotten to that point where they are getting a lot of warnings for them to leave you alone and there's a lot of people that are refusing to do that and for that to take place there's a lot of people in your in your family especially if you have wiccans pagans uh all those different things warlocks and stuff like that in your bloodline there's a lot of people that are trying to mess with you because you have been chosen to be able to you know stop generational curses all these different things has been happening in our bloodlines for a long time you know you've been chosen for it you've been going through a hell of your life they've been sending different people to you know it, it's like you're seeing the one demon jumping in from the same one they all got the same cause and when i'm seeing it it's like you're seeing that they have the same actions the same you know the 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 same sayings the way they're doing things you know it, it's jumping it's like jumping from every person to try to get towards you or um you have different people in your family that were even on the 1111 portal or even during you know halloween and all this stuff they've been trying to take stuff from you trying to make sure that they can take your essence trying to make sure they can take all your powers uh the things that they're re going even through akashic records and even trying to uh manipulate timelines to be able to you know go back and being able to change different things off and write you off for your own existence that's how crazy things are getting and it gets to that point where it's like a family meeting that's going in the ancestors is like look we chose this person for this you keep getting in the way of that you about to be ripped out of your existence and this is how bad it's going to get they have been cut out their own bloodline this is how bad is it and it was just like the way I, I was trying to explain it to if anybody ever seen the movie Dr. Sleep 
you know how it was like those dark ones whatever that is they were taking the essence out of people just to power them own selves up this is how they stay young this is how they keep going and these are the different things that's going on because you're a person you may not even know that there was these different things that was instilled in you but yet you're being able to put this on the limelight and it's not even you know you've been put on the spotlight to be able to do it like you could be doing the things like I'm doing and you're being guided to speak a lot of these things and you're being watched by enemies you're being watched by different parts of your family that's trying to do any and everything to shut you down and for these things to be happening it got to that point where they are no longer protected and that's not a good thing it's gotten to that point where I didn't even know this was possible they're cutting this out of our own bloodline like if they told you look we told y'all to stop messing with that person you keep sending karmics that way you keep sending all this hell into their life all these different things is coming right back to you and when it's coming right back to you it's being illuminated anything that they kept doing on these last you know powerful you know moon phases and stuff like that this, these things have been very detrimental towards their path you're doing all you can to shut that person down while well, all they're doing is just being followed to do what they need to do and for them to be doing that they're trying to wipe you out of existence and for that to happen they're getting all their powers taken anything that they've been you know working on for the last umpteen years it don't matter who they are it's on that when they are up, up on that it, it's at that situation where they are on the way it ain't even going to the upper room it's going to the lower room you know it's that bad where they have taken their powers in way it makes it so bad where that person has so much hate for you because you're that person that's moving the way you're supposed to you're enlightened in ways you didn't even know how it's like you weren't asked to have this but they placed this in you because they knew you were going to be that person that was going to be you know you were used as the scapegoat you'd be turning to the goat you know, you're being that person that's rearranging everything that they never, they, they wanted to make sure that never became possible. And they're doing that with you. And just because of that, family is taking all their powers away and making them, making them sit there and show, since you hate this person so bad and you're trying to steal stuff, how about we give them everything that was instilled in you, that was passed down to you through bloodline. And then on top of that, anything, they don't know, that it's just like anything that is attached to them. Whether or not this is related, blood related, whatever, they're damn they're damning their own bloodline. Like any if they're they're like if it's an aunt, great aunt, whatever, or a great grandmother or whatever, and they're still living, anything that comes from that direct bloodline that comes in, like if there it could be a child that didn't even know nothing. Next thing you know, something's gonna happen to somebody else's child and stuff like that. This is not something I'm wishing on nobody, but this is what it's going to. And they told them you're gonna be messing up your own bloodline if you continue to keep doing this. Or or you're gonna be damnating yourself to the point where you can be taken out just because you keep doing this and they keep uh doing uh oh dang oh uh, shoot you see why my nose is itching and crazy but it's getting that bad and for that to happen they're taking all their powers away they're stripping them all of spiritual protection you're just walking limbo like if anybody knows that that person's good for playing black magic on them and you may have did something to their family and they know you did it you have no protection so whatever they're sending towards that way they're going to catch it and it could be oh okay it, you're a free game you are a free agent now and that's how bad it is so anything that has been sent your way unseen and seen is all all it is is revealing you know it's it's thinning your veils and snatching veils off and it's strengthening you in powerful ways you never seen coming and the way they're telling me to tell you now the way they're wanting you to know is that you you can speak things and you're like wait a minute this happened and next thing you know you may hear it and repeat it in a song or repeat it in, in in a conversation or you can be on here on youtube and you can hear somebody say it it could be in a tarot card reading it could be in a video like this and you, you know you're seeing that or they're telling you okay anything um this is how you know this is your your you know your your moment this is for you and your your confirmation you're seeing a lot of moon symbols like it could be you know somebody could be talking about it you know in a song or you're seeing a symbol of it like you're seeing a, a person and you see the big moon or you going outside you can see the moon and you feel some kind of stimulation within yourself you know your heart's beating a lot harder you may feel a crack in it because it's opening up your you know it, it's in, you know you're you're getting it's like you're going through a spiritual mutation and the thing is moving rapidly like you're, you're getting hard pressures here it feels like your head's about to explode you may even hear cracking up there and you're feeling the cracking down here to where it feels like a panic attack or a heart attack. It's only triggering between your um, 
uh, they're saying it's the sacral chakra that's being stimulated or uh, intensified. You know, those are the different things that's taking place along with your third eye, your crown chakra, and your heart chakra. It's being very, it, it, it's just like, it'll feel like you're going through a mist of a panic attack and they're telling you, don't worry, this is something natural. It, you know, it's going through, but it may not, you know, it may happen for a minute and it'll stop and then it'll come back again. So there's something that you need to know what you're doing. They're telling you to balance yourself, either, you know, burn sage, you know, burn certain, um, you know, if you have your crystals, wear your crystals, uh, you know, meditate. These are the different things that's coming in because you're getting so many downloads. And it's like the downloads is creating your emotions to be all off balance. Like you can be sad one minute, depressed one minute, angry the next, ready to fight somebody the next. You're feeling defeated, feeling depleted one minute. You feel like you don't have control over your emotions because you're getting all this energy. Because you don't know what has been happening in the dark on you. There's been so many people that has been trying to stop you where you may know that people are different people are running these spells on you because they've been doing it, you know, from Halloween all the way until now, you know, any, any moon, they've been doing a lot of moon magic on you. And these are the different things that's taking place, but they already knew, you know, cause they're going to permission. They're even going to great, they're getting great lengths to go in a graveyard dark. They're trying to raise deads and stuff like that. They're doing all these different things. And then taking these things into consideration. They know, they already know if they get caught with those situations with, through the ancestors. The ancestors is not playing when it comes to you. They are not coming. They are not playing when it comes to you. So it's just like when we told you no to stop doing this because the ancestors are coming to different family members and saying, we don't told you not to do this. They don't care how y'all relate it. You know, they don't matter because if they pick that person, regardless of, you know, how you related to that person, if it's still in the bloodline, who they chose is who they chose. You can't get mad because they chose that. And if you do get over it, because it's at that point where if you start putting that person's life in danger and you keep sending death towards their way, you are sending mayhem towards that way, confusion and chaos towards that way is only creating a hailstorm for that person that keeps sending it to you. And it's getting to that point where they know they're in too deep and they're going to continue doing that. And now it's at that point where they are been severed from the bloodline. You are highly protected. But they are a free agent. So if you're going through these different things. These are the different things that are taking place. So pay attention. If you're having you know, very intense dreams. Where they're showing you you know, stimulation that's going on you. Where you may be glowing different. Your lights feels different. Your aura is like very intensified. Like you're starting to have... You know, you're seeing people's thoughts. You're seeing different things that they do in the dark that they, you know, rather say discreet about. Or these are different things that, you know, they may be speaking ill of you. And they'll be telling you, hey, don't talk to that person. Hey, this this person, don't go this way. Go th Don't go that way. You know, hey, you know, today, you know, put on back burner. If you cannot go to work today, don't go. And I'm not saying this for you to be heavily clawing off of work because some folks don't like their job. So, but, but they're telling you there'll be different things that they're telling you, giving you um, warnings about. But they're being instilled in you. And so those are the different things that's taking place where you're feeling a lot more sensitive than you usually do. And as soon as I keep saying that, oh my God, my nose. And I guess, I mean, that was a gift. Thank you. Yeah, these are the different things because this is like really triggering off my my my, my indication thing. <laughs> it was like I got a little indication thing in there when I'm on right on right on uh right on subject that I need to be. But these are the different things that's taking place into your life where um you are really getting strengthened in really incredible ways that you did not see coming. So all you know is the, like they're telling you don't worry. You'll see a lot of different things that'll come up. Like if you're on um I know uh, a lot of people where I'm seeing different people like that are on um, Instagram on different stuff like that. You may be going through a search thing and I'll tell you no worries. Don't worry about it or you're protected um, or love is shielding you in your direction and stuff like that. They're letting you know you're protected through all the different things that's been placed onto your life. You know, these are the different things that are stimulating you to become a, a better person. And it's like, it is really giving you that power. So it's just like different people are doing the big no-no. It's just trying to, you know, do these confusion and chaos spells or, 
you know, trying to put you through things where it's trying to make you sabotage your own blessings and stuff like that by creating, you know, uh, repetitive loops of illusion and stuff like that. They're being heavily punished for the things that's taking place into their life and you are going to be okay. You know, these are the different things that is taking place and not realizing it's sent to be detrimental for you, but it's going to be victorious for you in, a, in, in the long run. So I hope you are able to resonate with the content of this video. I leave all my content, uh, my content, my, con my content. <laughs> my contact information in the description box below it's all about spiritual networking to be able um to uh to be able to help you on spiritual networking you know whether you you know you may want to speak on different things or there's different things you may have gone through and you're really just trying to find an answer towards that i'd be able to i love to be able to help or you just need somebody just to listen to you because you don't want to be judged you know i'm here for that as well you know whatever we speak on is highly confidential and i help out the best way i can i always share um uh what is it my podcast and different um uh posts here as well um, just to be able to enlighten you, uplift you, give you comfort when they're feeling doubt, and even give you a little giggle, if, even when times are really hard and stressful. You know, want to be able to bring that to light toward towards you to be able to help you. You know, get you throughout the day. Um, if you ever um, feel generous enough to drop a donation, Cash App is there as well. You know, um, any vibrations you're needing, any vibes you're needing, whatever uh, to help you stay. You know, current on your Stay current on your um your vibes to be able to help you to bring your manis into fruition. I'm sending that all towards your way. Whether it's consistency, determination, motivation, you know, preparation, all those different things. I'm sending that towards your way. You know, you're really going through some trying things right now that's really trying to steer you off track. Keep going. Stay woke. You know, you got the potential and the light to be able to conquer and overcome anything that's sent your way. You know, the devil wants to make you doubt that, you know, because he sees all that within you. So you keep going, um, you know, all through this week. Send that love and protection uh, towards your way. Well, even for your days to come, sending love and protection towards your way, whatever you're needing to get through your moments and your days. You know, I'm sending that towards your way. You know, even through social distancing, make sure you give out love, light, positivity, birth, vibe, frequency. You never know. All those things that really can take somebody a long way. And just for you doing it, just, you know, for, uh, you know, love and intention, you know, loving intention and positive intentions to take you even further. So much love to you, I say. Shalom. God bless. Namaste. Peace.